All right, guys, let's watch this and talk about it after. My mother slumped this morning. Jesus! They took her to the hospital. Oh, my Jesus! My mother-in-law! Yes. My mother-in-law! Yes, 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 okay. Uh, what happened? What happened? We just... We, 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 the doctor said that we, we need the sum of 100,000 naira before they can start treating her. Please. 100,000. Please, please, okay, please help me. 100,000, 100,000, Yes, 100,000 100, naira. Hey, mommy, mommy, what I have here now is 30,000, but um, I will, I will run around today. By the end of the day, I will make sure I complete the money for you. You put a new wig. Hmm. Ah, Not ah. just a new wig. A very expensive one at that. You don't mean it. Guess what? What? That regular guy gave me the money. Joma. So EGK gave you money for this? After paying the hospital bills? I don't understand. Huh. Like, I don't understand. How much is the hospital bills? Huh. Eh? How much? That peanut? That peanut that he paid? I'm not shouting now. It's been a week. I've not heard from you or seen you. I miss you now. What did I do this time? Oh, my phone. Hello, my love. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I'll see you soon, okay? I'm coming. All right, baby. I love you too, baby. What, what, what is the meaning of this nonsense now? What's the, who, who, who are you saying hello, baby, baby, baby on the phone with? What's the meaning of this rubbish now? Eh? I, I, I demand to know what's going on right now. We are done. Yes, that is what is going on. We are done. Aji, am I a joke to you? You are just an ordinary carpenter boy. So if you know what is good for you, go. Misty. You're hurting yourself. This torture for me, Joma, is too much. You have to put yourself together. Thanks for bringing me back to limelight. For making me understand that love lies on different thorns. Love for love, bestie love, and so on. Thank you. All right, guys, so let's talk about this one, Mind Forever. Um, if you guys have not seen the movie, the link would be in the description. Now, this is really something that we need to discuss because it happens to a lot of younger people. You know, when you meet somebody, you are still, and I'm talking about as a guy, um, you know, you are still fresh, young, haven't really figured out your life. And, you know, you start this relationship, maybe something you started in school while in the union, maybe something you started right after, but you haven't really figured your life out yet. And, you know, here you are with a girl that you're, you know, hopelessly in love with or not, but, you know, most likely hopelessly in love with. And amidst trying to set yourself up, figure out your future, you are dealing with a relationship that demands your time demands your money uh, and you know demands your attention now in most cases the girls that you meet are also young like you the only difference is that most of the time girls grow faster you know they grow faster in the sense that, you know, the man that's going to marry them is most likely way older than that their boyfriend's age. Because the guy is usually maybe, let's just say, 20 to 26, you know, and, you know, the lady is maybe 20 or 22, whatever the case is. But, you know, in most cases, the guy is still struggling when somebody that's, you know, more set up in life would come for the girl. Now, if that doesn't happen, then, you know, you'll be lucky to maybe end up getting married to the love of your life. But in most cases, you know, the lady doesn't hang around that long. And as you guys can see in this particular one, the girl, of course, left him and moved on to some other person that was already well established. You know, here is the thing. And this is an advice that I'll give to younger guys, you know. When you're out of school and you're still trying to figure yourself out, don't focus on women. I know that you may already have fallen in love with somebody maybe while in the uni or maybe somebody outside the uni, but the bottom line is that you're still trying to figure yourself out. When you take out your time, you take out your whatever small finances you have and you take your attention and you dish it all on a girl. It derails you from focusing on your own dreams. I try to look at this from different points of view. And the bottom line is that there's no way around it. You're going to have to give up time. 
that you don't have, finances that you don't have, and attention that you need for your own personal growth, you're going to take all these things and focus it on a lady, on a girl that probably also doesn't know what she wants or, you know, in life yet. So, I would now advise guys, if you're at that age bracket, focus on your goals, focus on your dreams, focus on your aspirations. You know, yeah, you can keep somebody as your friend, but, you know, don't turn her into your whole life because it's going to derail you. And believe me, you know, it's easier for a girl to move on because the truth is that girls marry up. So before you know it, maybe somebody that's there is something that's already established would come for her. And then all those time and effort you put into her will be gone, you know. And even if somebody doesn't come, sooner or later, you're going to realize that all that time and effort you were putting in is setting you back from accomplishing your own goals, from becoming somebody in life too. You know, uh, in most cases, as you guys all know, Nigeria is hard now. So um, if you're lucky to just get a nine to five job that's paying you well, then, you know, you're good. But in most cases, many people have to resort to doing one business or another here or there. And that requires time and concentration, which if you're focusing on a girl, you're not going to have for yourself. So, you know, guys, try to try to pay a little bit more attention to your personal growth when you're still in that youthful, young age, 20, 22, 25. Focus on you and grow you. Women. Are always gonna be there you know focus on your growth first and then come back for the woman of your dreams you know at that point you're at least gonna have more to offer to that relationship and then of course the most important part is that you yourself you're gonna be ready for what's next in life which could be marriage which could be a transition to something else but you're gonna be ready you know with that girl that you now have so that's it for this one guys just a little lesson for you know for the younger guys out there focus on you at that age you know if you love this kind of content please like share follow subscribe comment too, please uh, this is cj from Atlantic studios and as always i'm here to deliver sense